what does UI and UX mean for uh, for our company, Preview Labs? So as we prototype games and, and interactive experiences, it's really all about the interaction. Like it's about how does it feel to play this game? Is is this is this an interesting game? So um, of course, and it's well doing prototypes. We kind of narrow it down to. A, a, a bit more limited scope, like we leave out all the fancy graphics, and, and we really focus on the actual interaction, the actual gameplay, and or the user experience when it's not like, like when it's not a game, but another application of the technology. Um, so that means, um, yeah, our users are users of, of of people that want to use this technology to develop software because we develop the prototypes for other people that are actually working on the on the game or on the on a, on a research application, or um, and so that means these are people that uh, yeah are in it could be businesses or people in scientific research. Um, so basically, um, it's kind of similar than what I heard from other panelists is that we you could see users um, we, we we could say we have two types of users. First of all, you have the direct user of what we do, which is our client, which is uh, for example. Uh, researchers or or a startup company that wants to make a game um, so there are direct users so there it's really important for us to gain a very thorough understanding of what is their vision what do they want to achieve in order to be able to narrow it down to something that can be prototyped and, and that they can try out and then get in front of their users so the prototypes are then then go to this second type of user which are, which are the actual players um, or participants in a research study, or it could, yeah. So basically different people that, that they, they show it to, so who the application is in, uh, finally intended for. So that's how we have kind of two layers of users that we have to take into account.